Hey, it's Phil from Philips Dynalight, and in this video, we're going to talk about the triggers function within System Manager. If I go to Maintenance, I have Triggers option, and I can add a trigger here. Now, what a trigger is, is basically it monitors the network, and if it hears a message that you've set it to listen for, then it will do the action. Simple as that. So this allows you to send messages across the bus or to have the system react to a change in state on the, on the network um, without you having to actually interact with it and, and uh, directly link that action. So for example, this trigger, let's say, is welcome staff, should we say? And I'll listen for an area preset message. I'll choose an area, let's say office, and the preset, preset one. So somebody walks into the office, they press preset one. I can then add actions. So I could create a macro to turn the offices on. I could create presets to turn the offices on. And I can build something. So you walk into the room, either occupancy sensor or a button press turns the first light on and that triggers the rest of the room to come on. Now that could be done in tasking and in other places, but if it's done here, it allows the end user to modify and refine that as the building matures over time. So it puts more power in the hands of the people on site. And that is triggers. It's pretty straightforward functionality, um, but yeah, give it a try. Let us know what you think. Thanks for your time.